If you do like my video, then please remember to like, share and subscribe. So today I'll be discussing about GIS, a topic which might sound familiar to a lot of people. GIS is a short form for Geographic Information System, which is a computer-based tool that examines spatial relationships, patterns and trends in geography. GIS also helps to show different kinds of data on one map itself, for example, streets, buildings, vegetations, etc. This also helps people to more easily understand, analyze and see the relationships and patterns. It also helps people to make better decisions using spatial data, such as finding the optimal route between two cities, weather forecasting or locating a new store location. GIS uses namely two different types of data, raster and vector data. Raster data looks like grids and stores information in the form of pixels, whereas vector data uses points, lines and polygons to represent each feature. GIS can store, manage, analyze and display data in a database using an attribute table which contains each and every information of each and every features. GIS also uses photographic or satellite data to capture and interpret the Earth's surface features. GIS can be used in various sectors including the IT sector. GIS can help the IT professionals to develop, manage and deliver location-based applications and services. Some of the applications of GIS in the IT sector include web mapping. GIS can be used to create interactive web maps to display geospatial information on the internet. Web maps can be used for various purposes such as tourism, education, navigation, business intelligence and social media. For example, Google Maps is a popular example of web mapping services which is used to provide directions, traffic information, street view as well as satellite imagery. Location intelligence GIS can be used to analyze and visualize spatial data to gain insights and to make proper decision. Location intelligence can be used for various purposes such as market analysis, customer segmentation, site selection, risk analysis, as well as optimization. GIS is used by Uber to provide location intelligence to its drivers and riders, such as optimal route, search pricing, and demand forecasting. Spatial data science. GIS can be used to apply advanced analytical techniques such as machine learning, artificial intelligence and big data analytics to spatial data. Spatial data science can be used for various purposes such as predictive modeling, pattern recognition, anomaly prediction and optimization. For example, ArcGIS is a platform by Esri that provides spatial data science tools for various companies such as health, transportation, energy, and conservation. Indomapping. GIS can be used to create indomaps that displays the layout and the features of indoor spaces. Indoor mapping can be used for various purposes such as navigation, asset management, facility management, and emergency responses. For example, Apple's indoor mapping data format is a standard for creating indoor maps that can be used by Apple Maps as well as other applications. Thus, we can see that GIS is a technology that can help us to understand the world in new and exciting ways. It will also help us to make better decisions using spatial data. GIS being a powerful tool can help us to enhance our knowledge and capabilities in this digital age.